In my hand, I have a 100 year old fishing lure. And in this video, we're gonna be fishing with it and seeing if it'll still catch fish after all these years. There it is, there it is, there it is. We just got the rain, so these bass are now fired up. Because of all that rain hitting the surface, gets these bass all fired up and ready to bite. Just like that. Good God, look at that. There it is. There it is. Here we go. Here we go. There it is. Oh, what is up, guys? We are back with another video, and in this video, we're gonna be fishing with this 100-year-old fishing lure and seeing if it'll still get some bites after 100 years. We gotta get one, at least. All right. All right. Come on. Come on. Come on. Wait a minute. There it is. There it is. There it is. We got one. Okay. Oh my gosh. Check that out, guys. Oh, he just popped off. All right. Wow. Little bass. Just a little guy. The fact that he bit this 100 year old lure. That is the cool thing about it, guys. Check that out. Maybe like this. All right, we're going to just like this. We're just going to let him sit for a little bit. Wait for him to kick back up. We'll go just like this. We'll go. There he is. There he goes. Right back out. We're going to do a slow roll in here. Slow retrieval. We just got the rain, so these bass are now fired up because of all that water. Because of all that rain hitting the surface, gets these bass all fired up and ready to bite. Just like that. Good God. Look at that. Look at that, guys. Bam, baby. Let's go. Let's go, guys. Let's freaking go, dude. Woo Let's go, dude. Check that out. On a hundred year old grandpa lore. We done got him. What the heck, dude? That is awesome. On the 100 year old lure. All right, there he goes. Went down, swam off. Time out for bullshit. Pay so I can sit right here and cast my lure away. Waiting all day. Get me a bite. It's a dang shame. What the bats are gonna do to people like me? People like you wish I could just wake up and catch me a bass, but it ain't true. It ain't true. Fishing for the large mouth with a hundred year old lord. Hey, what's up? Which one over there? You fishing this one or no? No. There it is. There it is. Here we go. Here we go. There it is. Oh, come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, come on. Oh, yeah. Nice. There he goes. Look at that. That is awesome. Swing release. I did not expect that, guys. We threw it at the other side of the bank. I couldn't see anything. I was just blind casting. Threw it at the other side of the bank. I got to reel in and just get exploded up on by a nice little three pounder or so that is cool man 100 years still banging out bass how about that yeah, shout out to that kid over there man he's the one that told me about the pond to go to i think gonna look good that kid to use the fish with the six cents base because i think it'll be really good that'll that'll help him catch some fish i'm asking what he's throwing me and then we'll just give him these he's here throwing a worm Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. In the middle, yep. Like tiny one following it. You should get I, them. I just had like a little one. What color is that? Oh, watermelon. Yeah. Watermelon seed. Weightless. Yeah, I do. Um, I do YouTube. I had this like 100 year old fishing lure right here, yeah. and I was like, yo, I want to try and um fish with that if I can, <laughs> you know. But 
Do you ever use six inch baits or no? Uh, no. No? No, I, I serve. Oh, really? oh, nice, yeah. nice. Nice, that's awesome, man. Yeah, I was gonna say, let me, uh, hold on. Let me see if I can set you up with something real quick. Try throwing this one out. So this is a three aught um, worm hook. Try tying that to there. Just do a weightless probably over here, like the way you have it right there with no weight at all. Mm -hmm. And then I'm just gonna give you these because I already have a whole pattern. I have a bunch oh, in my car. And no, 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 man, it's all good. And you can try throwing either this color is my favorite one, dark melon red, or this black and blue. And then you can just try putting that on there, and I guarantee you'll get a bite. If you go over there at the other end, you should definitely get that bigger one to bite. That'll be good. But you got some scissors or something on you yeah, or no? Uh, over there I got some. Actually, I got some right here. Yeah, that'd be good. Yeah, because I think that'll work really, really good. Yeah. So you do a lot of fishing or no? Or just uh, mostly yeah. surfing? That's yeah, it? I do a lot of surfing. I do competitions. Oh, nice, nice. That's awesome, man. Yeah. Tom, and I just... on video your fish? Oh, yeah. I saw video. a splash. I didn't know if you caught it or not. It looked like a catfish were far away. Yeah, dude, it was insane. I threw it at the other end, and... Uh, yeah, I, I didn't even know there's nothing there and then it was like basically on top water and then so and I just see and I'm like oh crap so I set the hook and then I got to do it. Texas rig or? Yeah I just I Texas rig that's all I do. So yeah. You know a Texas rig or no? Yeah. Okay yeah. Yeah Yeah, just like I do it like this. I ran out of bass hooks. So yeah so I this like should it. definitely be good. This is my favorite color. The dark melon red yeah. is actually one of my favorite colors to use in general for like bass fishing. Yeah I love watermelon red. Or the uh, black and blue. You yeah, can do that but I just. Back there there's like a yells at us every time if oh, we're fishing back there. Oh crap. Oh man. See there it is man. Oh. I, I told you dude it's like immediate bite. Like when you use that bait it's like pretty much immediately you're gonna get bit. So yeah that should be good. We'll make it we'll make it weedless as well yeah. by poking it in there. And let me see yeah let me see if your drag is your fixed in. Uh Joseph went fishing. So Joseph went fishing. Oh yeah that should be good. Yeah that should be good. There was like three years ago there was like a big gator like 12 foot gator in here eating everything. There's people swimming in this pond too. And they didn't know, they hired people to kill this gator because it was like apex predator killing oh, yeah, everything. Dude. Yeah, way. I bet and man, that's crazy. Shot it right there in the head, right like on there. Oh my I God. I got to sit on top of its head. <laughs> There's this one by my dog, not scared of anyone. Someone's been feeding it. This thing's like 11 foot going around. Just, it's not as bad as this one, but it's close. That was clearing out the lake mats. It just came up to him. He was like, oh, oh crap. crap. He didn't move. He was shocked. It's like in those horror movies where like a gator just stays there. And oh yeah. stares him down. <laughs> oh my god. Like, like, oh, crap. That's like, crazy. I was watching my dad. I was like, dad, get out of the water right now. I once had it on the hook before too. This rod right here, like, came apart. Oh my and god. It was also on a bluegill. Being here, yeah. so that's really good. But. Yeah, give it a go though. You should be getting a bite pretty soon, actually. Yeah, yeah there it is. Oh, see it? See there? There it is. <laughs> that's what I said, man. It's like a me literally immediately bite, like right when you drop it down, like oh, they go you. they go crazy over it. Yeah, dude. It's my favorite bait in, like in the world, honestly, to use is this one. The black and blue. And this one's actually the best, honestly. It's a dark melon red, is what they call it. Yeah. It's fun, you know. I always try to fish as much as I can, man. Stick to it, you know. If you can, yeah. uh, even if you want to start doing YouTube videos, that'd be awesome. If you start like yeah, right I now, YouTube for surfing. Oh, cool. Yeah, that's awesome, man. Hey, I was going to ask you as well, man. Um, you said you got a YouTube channel? Yeah, I'm a, I'll subscribe to you too. A-S-E. Oh, uh, space. Space. And then S-T. S-T. I. I. And S-O-N. And S-O-N. Yeah, cool, man. Yeah, I'll, I'll, ch I'll check your videos out too, man. All right. Yeah. Appreciate it. Have a good day, man. All right, guys. It's going to about wrap it up for this video. This has been such a fun two days of fishing with the 100-year-old lure and yeah guys i mean as you guys saw in this video this thing definitely still pumps out bass it still attracts bass after all of these years of fishing with it 100 years later this thing is still actually able to catch bass so that alone is very very cool and i was going to be happy if i caught anything on it let alone some two to three pounders man that was very very cool yeah as always make sure you all are liking the videos commenting on the videos subscribing to the channel and we'll see you guys in the next video peace